clowns. Doing something different this time. I'm gonna do a voiceover. So today we're gonna do some my daily. It's like kind of my notebook kind of thing. Not my daily catch on or anything like that. Um, I'm gonna use this monthly. I already did the white out for the days. We're gonna do the monthly. We're gonna use some of those. And then according to Ali's 80s, 90s, and the bubbles maybe. See you. Let me get that out of the way. Be getting this ready and we can start. So we hear the noise in the background of the TV. I haven't done a voiceover. Why well, I've been doing voiceovers because my husband's down here, Will's down here, and I'm kind of embarrassed to do that in front of him, talk to y'all in front of him. But we're gonna do it anyway. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this side yet. This is gonna be dates, of course. Um, with the highlighters, or the mild liner, these are the Sharpies. So they're like the mild liners, basically. What do have? But I'm thinking to make boxes with these. I think. But for right now, well, that voiceover, well, that live kind of didn't last. <laughs> We're watching Family Guy, and I was saying some of the kind of stuff that I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna get canceled real fast for that. But if y'all know Family Guy, y'all know Family Guy. It's Peter Griffin saying some random stuff. I don't think, I'm not offended by what they say, but I'm not gonna take the chance on YouTube or anybody saying anything about my video and it get this, you know, whatever. Um, but yeah, uh, what were they saying? I remember, but anyway. I was doing the video like that. I don't know if y'all like the other one or the, this way, whichever one. Y'all can tell me in the comments. It doesn't really matter. Um, I want to get used to talking in front of my husband a little bit more, but I just can't. I'm still. Me da vergüenza mucho. I know y'all probably saying you embarrassed. Yeah, I am. <laughs> but on this one, I was doing like those. I got the bubbles. I thought the bubbles were gonna go like just as the background, but I know you can't really see them on here um from according to ali those bubbles all these are from according to ali like i said in the beginning of the video and this was my first purchase from her and i'm pretty happy with it really really happy with it it was really cool she shipped pretty fast um it was really nice like i like the the quality is really good um i did get these bubbles the 80s and 90s some whales and the the Halloween uh, papel picao. Uh -huh. Yeah, I got those. I got two of those, and then the whales, and then the um, these over here, and then the the, the uh, bubbles. But I got the bubbles in this set because I wanted to use them together. Uh, if you have never gone over there to check her out, according to Ali. It's a pretty cool, I like her stuff. It's like, this is my first, like I said, this is my first order from her and I really do like it. Uh, Marisol uh, was the one that actually told me to check it out. So I actually did and I kind of like, you know, went for it and got some stuff. But um, yeah, definitely go check out her shop for sure. I'm not an affiliate. I'm pretty sure you can get, an, um, <clears throat> Marisol is an affiliate. So if you need a code, if you decide to buy something from her, um, go check out Marisol's thing. I'll leave her on, I'll tag her on here so you can get her affiliate or her code to use it for Ali. But I'm just right now just putting the stickers, the bubbles. This is going to be like the bubbles are the background, basically. Kind of like what I did with my coffee before, the coffee spread that I did before. So these are just going to be like in the background. Just a little extra, you know what I mean? But hopefully everybody's having a good weekend. This should be up Saturday evening. Um, 
kind of been in a planner rut. I don't know. If y'all want to see something from me, like idea wise, spread wise, anything like that, leave a comment in the in the leave a comment on, on the video, and I'll see what I can do. Um, other than that, this is a monthly page. Like I was saying earlier, it's a monthly. But I'm gonna have a heavy week at work. So I'm thinking I'm going to use this for work. I was going to use it just to take notes and stuff like that. Like what I have to do, remind myself like the day ahead. Like for, usually for these these simple, what is the simple layout? The dashboard ones, I usually just use that like for the plan ahead. Um, like Sunday, I'll sit down and just write down what I need to do for sure. And then Monday evening, I'll do for what's Tuesday. For Tuesday, I'll do for Wednesday, stuff like that. So that's why I use this one. Um, anything that has to be done the day before, the next day, that's kind of like important. I use it that way. So that's what I use the, these, um, the simple layout. I mean, you know how like it doesn't have like a, it's usually the both pages are like the dashboard. So that's why I got this one, the monthly. And I was like, well, I can use this one. And it'll just, it's all a list. So it'd be pretty good. Cause I have, like I said, I do have a busy Monday or pretty week. It should be busy all week. So I wanted to just do this one. I came not not knowing like exactly how I was gonna decorate it because I didn't think anybody, well, I didn't think anything of it. Like I didn't think of head, I didn't, anything like that. But my brain wasn't to where I wanted to create something like, create something, create something like off the top of my head. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I, come, I was like, let me just do this. But I've been kind of, I don't know I can say, um, I have been kind of distancing myself from some stuff on Instagram. Um, it's just been kind of, over some of the stuff has been overwhelming for me, like the chats and the groups and all that. Um, so I kind of got out of a lot of them. I was kind of getting... I don't want to say it was getting anxiety, but hearing my phone going off and hearing all the chats and everything coming from me, like me in September, like late August, early September, I never had social media and for it to be whatever I thought was going to be able to handle it plus work and all that. And man, it is, it's a lot. Like it was a lot. So I had to like, I talked to my, I talked to Will about it. And he was like, maybe you should just like cut out some of the, some of the stuff, like the chat, like the chat pods or the pods that they call them. And then like the groups that I was in. Um, so I did that. And then also with the, with some of the loops, like with the loop group and all that, that I got out of, I did get out only cause it was, yes, it was fun. Yes, everything was great. Nothing against the groups or nothing like that, but I was feeling kind of, how would you say? Like I wasn't able to, I think like I was, I felt like I wasn't able to, to do me. Like, yes, my spreads are my spreads. Yes, the themes are the themes, but I guess I went, I went over my head and then it's not like none of the group's fault or anything like that. It's just like me. Um, and I want to do me like this is something I want like this was something I wanted to do and this kind of stuff I want to do like I want to do a spread when I want to do it you know what I mean a theme that I want to do when I want to do it um but yeah that's kind of what I got out and I don't know if anybody's noticed <laughs> but yeah I got out myself um out of everything so the only thing I'm doing is just Sarah and Mojo, and that's it. Um, and of course, I'm helping Booknook. I've always helped Booknook. Christina, if y'all don't know who she is on my Instagram, Booknook Prints. She's a digital shop. She's super great. She actually... Um, I'm looking at my video while I'm talking to you, and I'm like... Oh, why did you do that? Like, you know, you were like, oh. like, I'm looking at everything I'm doing. I'm like, Jesus Christ. And then you're going to remove it. Start all over again. <laughs> like, anyway, but yeah, like Christine from Booknook Prince, like she does a digital. Um, 
she's been super cool to me like i felt like some stuff like i have my oblig not obligations but i have like my my loyalty or whatever to some people because you know they follow me when i had only like two three hundred followers and they were always there for me you know what i mean um but yeah i it's it is what it is you know what i mean like i guess i'm learning what social media really is some of it i don't like some of it i do like and you know what i mean i just i'm not gonna be ever be one to i guess like take advantage of a shop or anything like that and like i said christina from book nook she always hooks me up when it comes to like her her stuff um but then I always like her, I, I always tell her like her stuff to help me out on Instagram a lot. Like her, I forget, it's the academia one. It was a real vampy one that I did. And then the, the, um, let's say Lost Boys, it's not though. Peter Pan one, that one like kind of like threw me in a projection where I wanted to go. Um, like her stuff kind of challenges me because they're not like your typical sticker books. You know what I mean? Like, you have to put them together. You have to do whatever. And it's, it's a set, yes, but you have to, like, kind of rack your brain. And with her stuff and some other of my spreads, like, they had stories behind them. And I kind of missed that. You know what I mean? And I couldn't do that. I had stopped doing that because, you know, I was in the, I was in the group. And I missed it. But I do, I did, like, explaining my my story like my my spreads i like the story the, either the story i came up with or you know the thoughts that came out of my head i liked doing that so y'all can see the different like see and understand what i'm coming where i'm coming from with the spread that i'm creating you know what i mean so i kind of wanted to go back to what i used to do basically and i think i was doing okay like i think i'm doing pretty good you know like i did get from August, late August to September. I started off in late August. My first post, I think, was September or like August 30th or something like that. But from zero subscribers to at 3,700 that I just looked, a little over 3,700. Like, I think I'm, I'm doing something that, you know, I should continue. Like, I shouldn't stray from what my thing is because what I was doing before, it was getting me my following, you know what I mean? Like, y'all liked what I was doing, y'all, you know, y'all followed me, of course. And I, you know, really appreciate that. And I don't want to stray from that. So, kind of just doing me a lot of the times um, from now on, if, you know, whatever it is, it is, you know what I mean? It's like, but yeah, that's the whole story. I don't know where I went on, but I'll digress with that. Um... But on this one with the Cordy and Alley stuff, it just so like it looks really good in picture, like really really good. Like I'm looking at the video because I edited it. And I'm looking at it now because I'm of course doing the voiceover. Like it looks really good, really really good. <laughs> like that's hard to find sometimes, but it's really good. Like in stickers, they're really 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 good. I like them. But. Other than that, I haven't really been up to nothing. I've been working a lot. Uh, let's see, working. Doja is doing good. Priscilla is doing good. Priscilla's actually up here with me today. We're both in the in the um, in the credit union because we're gonna take a nap for a little bit. We're big nappers, so I have to take turns with them because Priscilla sleeps with Will and dojo sleeps with me and that's only because our children can't be together so we have to and i'm not gonna have one by themselves you know what i mean like i'm not gonna so it's like will sleeps in one room and i sleep in the other room sometimes um and then we're like little kids and we go sneak off and do whatever we have to do <laughs> she's gotta keep that spice alive y'all <laughs> keep that little spice alive no but um yeah they can't they can't be together they've been together since they were babies well dojo was one 
Priscilla was months old and all of a sudden like two years ago they just always fighting they couldn't be around each other and it's just I don't know where it's coming from and tried everything it doesn't work and to this last time it was a real bad fight uh, I got bit Will got bit um, it wasn't purposely like they were trying to separate them and you know dogs will be dogs but yeah that's what's happening with that but now everything's pretty good mm, we'll be going to austin tonight for a rave i think dead mouse is gonna be up there so in case you want to know uh will love dead mouse <laughs> he doesn't look like the type to like that music but he does i don't like it i'm more of he likes the music doesn't have any sound like any lyrics or like like just like that like we used to call it pots and pans but like i can deal with trance and house progressive and all that like back in the early 2000s you know what i mean like do you think you're better off alone like lsdj you know what i mean or like lasgo or dd or um who else um that sandstorm song you know what i mean melanie c from the spice girls um like that kind of era of music i like he doesn't like that he likes like just like i don't know what it's even called dead mouses i don't know what it is but it's like it's not edm i do like edm but edm has drops and they have some music in it like some song, like lyrics in it and i like that but yeah so on this one just an fyi i've never really done a whole spread with like i've seen i think like i want to say who is i've been watching a lot of um not a lot of like i'm all stalking or somebody <laughs> um kismet kismet does a lot of like liner stuff and markers and stuff like that and i like the way she does her stuff it's super cute i don't follow her go follow her but like she does a lot of stuff like that and i like it a lot so i was like let me just try this and i was gonna leave it as is like just the three lines on each one or two but i was like why not just fill it up <laughs> let's y'all see right now like i just get it filled up so i was like why not and then i did other stuff with it but it looks really really like i'm shocked that i came out like pretty good like i wasn't expecting it like was not expecting it at all but it came out really really good i really 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 liked it so i'm like thinking right there like do i add more do i not add more and then will couldn't hear me when i was saying to come here that my like was like waiting to do it i was like okay let me just do this color stuff because i'm can't do the colors but we'll figure it out <laughs> i was like I'm just pulling from one side and making sure I don't use them again. So I'm just like, you'll see right now what I mean. Because you see, I pull from the right. And I'll throw it to the left. But yeah. Like after I did this one, I was like, hmm, it looks good. Let me just continue doing that. So I just did that the rest of the way. It's crazy to me, like... I can, like, I was doing this. Like, I was doing the voiceover. I wasn't doing the voiceover. I was doing the thing. But, like, during that time, <laughs> I don't know how people, like, I don't mind talking to y'all like that or whatever, but, like, I'm doing right now, but, like, while I'm doing planning, because when I'm by myself or I'm just zoning out, I forget that the camera's on. And I'm like, oh, I'm supposed to be talking. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> for a whole time, like, while I was doing this, I was like, hmm just literally in my head thinking and i was like oh shit the camera's on like totally forgot about it but i can't like like i don't know i get zoned out literally like for real i get zoned out and don't know like what the hell but it's just i want to eventually like do the whole it's less editing i can take that much because if you're just talking through it, it's less editing like if you just talk through the video and all that because i don't have to at first i have to edit and then do the voiceover so it takes less time to do all that that's why i want to kind of start doing that but i need to do it like 
I need to figure out like a schedule for, for me to do it because this is that it takes too long, but I can probably pump out more videos this way if I were to do like not the voiceover and actually do it like the right way, like a normal YouTuber, not like this. <laughs> But yeah, like right there, I was like, oh man, this came out really cool. Like, I like the way it looks, me personally. Like, I don't know. Like, I like it, but then I was like, oh man, with the other side now. Like, the left side took all my creative juices and now I have to worry about this other side. <laughs> I just wish I had a quote. That's the only thing I do wish I had, but then I was, nah. I was like, it's gonna be really functional. Let me just do that, you know what I mean? That's me thinking like to myself. Oh, I forgot I wasn't using it. And I showed you the washi right there because I was like, I forgot I wasn't using it. But I was like, mm, we'll figure something out with it. To where to use it because I, I do want to use it. But then I didn't. And I was looking for the router and I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just do this and go from there. See, like right now i'm just like forgetting to talk to you because i'm like zoned out on this what i'm doing i'm like man i should have done it this other way like i'm thinking i'm watching an actual youtuber do something <laughs> but yeah anyway what do y'all think of like this simple layout like where both sides are just like kind of like the way the right page is like, do y'all use it? Do y'all not use it? And if y'all do use it, like, what do y'all use it for? Um, like I said, I just use it for, like, my... Like, my important, important, important task that I have to do the next day. So this is, like, my... My pre-game to the next day that I have to complete. You know what I mean? If that makes sense. I, this is... This is the ones I use. And sometimes I decorate them, sometimes I don't. But it's not a big thing. You know what I mean? Because I do use it more functionally but since i was gonna bring out this monthly with it this time i was like you know what let me just add some stickers and then uh, according at least mail came in so that's why and then i messed up there because i was supposed to if you saw me tap on the thing i was supposed to put that corner box that that box on the bottom i was supposed to put it up more so it's some busy like box, box, like every other box. You know what I mean? But of course I messed up and I was like, oh wait, I can do what I did across the way. And then that way it'll be right under them. And then it'll work the same, it'll work, it'll work out. You know what I mean? It looks like, like it'll look like it's supposed to be like that. So that's what I'm doing there. So I come out just like, oh, I just cover up. Like I purposely did that. Cause I didn't want a box next to all those lines. So now I'm doing it on the bottom, so it can look just like the top. Pretty much like, oh, it's supposed to look like that. Boxing and under it lines, you know what I mean? But wondering like, like to get y'all's honest feedback like what do y'all want to see from me on my youtube like i can do more cakes i can do more spreads i can do a vlog type thing i don't know what y'all want to see like let me know what y'all think or what y'all know or what y'all want to see more of um if you want to see like how i layer stuff or if i if you want to see like anything just let me know like not anything anything of course <laughs> um See, I used the big washi, but then I was like, wait, let me see if I have a thin washi. And I did have the thin washi. So I was like, oh, let me just use that. This is from um, the new release from Live La Posh that just came out. And I don't know why I was struggling with it so much to get that dang washi out. But I did.
there was one like a regular one and then there's another one that was like kind of like diamonds but i was like yeah nah and then i put in this one back i was like let me put this back i don't know about y'all but i like this new washi i don't know if it's a new washi she's been using or she made with this new release i i don't think i had washi from her before so i don't know but i like her washi though like this washi is really really like i took it off and i put it i was like oh shit like this washi is really good so that time i put it back i was like oh, i'm not gonna throw this away usually it's like if i get it from amazon for like five bucks for ten i'm like fucking wrong i put it back because it's gonna cause whatever like i'll like take off and i'll just be all over the place so i was like yeah i'm not gonna do that but with this one it felt really good like it was really really good quality you see it was pretty good i don't know if you're able to see it but yeah those were a good buy i think and they should still be available if y'all want them and y'all can find an affiliate link because <laughs> i don't have one not yet maybe sometime but not yet so i come with the thin one so i was like oh this will work perfectly and i like the way it came out like it looks like it all tied in perfectly like everything tied in so i was kind of excited about that And then here i was like shit i cut it off too fast too short so i had to like go in and fix it but I like the way it came out like i don't i usually put the washi all the way to the end but with this one i didn't like i cut it off like right where the little box starts what do y'all do like do y'all cut it like just leave it because to me it was real, it's easier that way but then i seen a lot of people like they'll cut where the black line ends for the boxes or like for the spread itself for like the layout they'll cut off but some people just go straight across the bottom like i could just go straight across the bottom most of the time but what do y'all do with that just curious because i don't see i see more of the cutting off from the black lines than usual than like just straight across But as you can tell, it's like coming together now. Like I also had a proud moment, like, fuck yeah, like I did this. <laughs> I made it tie together, like, it made it look good to me at least. You know, I like, I love the way this one came out. Like it came out really, really good. And then the black, I think, just like made everything like cohesive, I guess you can say. You see, if I would have gone straight across, it would have just been one straight line. So it wouldn't have even looked like boxes. That time I did the black line, like only up to the lines and then cut it off the washi. That way it can have that separation. So I kind of like, I really, really liked it there. And then here, just to separate the box, the drawn box from the lines, I did the same thing.
and then i don't know why that little one that washi i just did right now i don't know why i like it so much and i just think it's because of the sticker and the way i cut in on the side like it was perfect like it just looks like it's supposed to be like that and i don't know why it kind of gives me like diner vibes i guess i think it's just like the black and white checkerboard it gives me like diner vibes But yeah, like, let me know in the comments, like, what kind of spreads y'all want to see, like, decoration-wise, or... Like, you want to see more vertical, you want to see more horizontal. You want to see more of my custom stuff where I don't use... I just use, like, note paper and just go from there, or, or like, let me know what y'all want. Like, I want to kind of, like, challenge myself a little bit more. I remember when I first got it, I challenged myself a lot um, when I first got on social media. And then... That's when Gabby and uh, Becca got my spreads because they kind of want like the whole thing about it, uh, which is the Merlin Monroe and the the Batman one. But yeah, like let me know what y'all kind of want to see. If y'all want to see the like, custom spreads like that, all like something or like more dashboard, more different layouts. Um, I haven't used my TM, my TM, my TN, my Traveler's Notebook, but that one is gonna be. I have to make up like a setup video for June ongoing for like the second, like, you know, halfway through the year. Cause that TM is going to be my new, um, not June. I'm lying to you. It's going to be in July, July 1st. I'm going to start using it as a replacement to my skinny classic from Happy Planner. So yeah, that's the plan. Like that's what I want to do. And then as you can tell, I love using my hand as a sticker dashboard. <laughs> it's crazy. And this is like one of the first videos I have done in a while that I'm actually using the weekend. Like I left it in there. I didn't like cover it up with the decoration or anything like that. Cause I need to make sure I have some stuff done for like Monday. I'm always working y'all. Like work is work. I know. And then look, I messed up right there. Cause I was thinking of something else and I was talking to Will cause he got up and I was talking to him and I messed up. I put 21 on Friday and the 21st is supposed to be Tuesday. Tuesday. Like the... I like to say the the English say it Tuesday, choose two is Tuesday, two like Tuesday, not Tuesday. It's stupid, I know. I get a kick out of that. Like the water, the water. Oh, that's more Brooklyn and probably water or Jersey. Anyway, yeah. If you ever meet me and you have an accent, <laughs> I'm telling you ahead of time. I will probably repeat some words you say, but it's just because it sounds crazy, like not crazy, but it sounds funny to me. So I'm repeating it for my own benefit, not to make fun of you. Just an FYI, if we ever meet you and me and you have an accent, I'm gonna say some words. I had a boyfriend who was from 
Philadelphia, and he used to say water, and then door, get the door, cut the lights, you know, he just had this little Philadelphia accent, and I was like, I, of course I fucking loved it, that's besides the point though, <laughs> but yeah. I think I'm done. I just need to put the May up here. And that's it. Get the May. Put it right there next to the cassette tape. Man, I used to have some good cassette tapes. Like a bunch of mixes. Especially the ones at night. Man, they were good. They were real good. What kind of mixtapes did y'all have? Like, did y'all have... I got a whole... I a whole bunch. And my dad built a... Used to build... He built... Oh, it was record shop, so I had a lot of cassettes and CDs because of him, my dad. But I finished it here. This is pretty much it. I liked it a lot. That one I'm really in love with. Like, I'm really, really liking it a lot, a lot. But that's it. Y'all have a good day. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for hearing me. I know I wasn't so like, excited and all that today, but this is it. Hopefully I enjoyed it. And I will see y'all back again, let's say by Wednesday. Bye.